do you need to put a title for your layout? Or do you want to annotate on the drawing? Here's how to make notes and annotations in AutoCAD. In this video, we'll show you how to create notes and affix dimensions on your drawing. Let's start with creating notes, labels, bubbles, and callouts. The annotation panel in the ribbon consists of different AutoCAD commands that help annotate your drawing with text and dimensions. Before inserting text in your drawing, it is important to set up the text style you prefer by clicking on the annotation menu and selecting the text style setting icon. Text style dialog box will appear. In here, you can set the default font name from a variety of options, font style, and specify the text height every time you use a text command. Once you're done, click Apply, then close the dialog box. When it's set, click on the mText command icon to start the command. Then, specify the corners of the type box. Now, type in anything you'd like to. Notice that the ribbon changes accordingly with the command. It provides you with quick access editing tools such as font style, font name, justification, and more. Once you're done, click on the closed text editor to terminate the command, or simply click outside the type box to do so. To enter into the text editor, Double-click the text you'd like to edit. Click outside the text box when you're done. That's how you insert a text field in AutoCAD. You can explore more options by clicking the inverted triangle below the mText command icon. Now, here's how to add dimensions in AutoCAD. You can create horizontal, vertical, aligned, and radial dimensions with the DIM command in AutoCAD. The type of dimension depends on the object that you select and the direction that you drag the dimension line to. First, let's set up the dimension style by clicking on the dim style icon in the annotation menu. Dimension style manager will then appear.
click on modify to change the preset settings whenever you insert dimensions in your drawing. Different tabs in the modify dimension style dialog box is available for your customizations. For example, you wish to change the size of the arrow of your dimensions. Do that by clicking Symbols and Arrows tab and specify the default size of the arrow every time you insert dimensions. Also, if you wish to modify the appearance of the units of your dimensions, you can click on the Primary Units tab and set it up. A preview is shown beside it. Click OK to save the settings and close the dialog box. Then, close the Dimension Style Manager dialog box. To insert dimensions, type DIM or DIM on the keyboard, then press the Enter key. Or you can click the DIM icon in the ribbon, then specify the endpoints of the line. You can also choose from the other dimensional styles available in the annotation panel such as linear, aligned, angular, arc length, radius, diameter, and others to annotate your drawing. And that's how you insert notes and several types of dimensions in AutoCAD. Explore other annotation options to learn more.